Hey guys, I got the headphones on so you know I've got to be doing an interview. And right now we're doing an interview with the guys who made this film, Muddy Corman. Now, uh, for those who don't know about Muddy Corman, it was partially shot here in Utah, which is awesome. And so it's fun to be able to talk with filmmakers that have come from, usually from out of state, and they believe these guys came from L.A. Is that is that about right, guys? Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's all right. right. All right. So coming out of L.A., coming back to Utah, and it seems like it's been a whirlwind event just getting this film ready for FilmQuest. Tell me about, first, what the film is about, guys, and kind of that adventure to get it ready for Friday. Yeah, uh, the film is about... Um, an art school that is uh, in financial trouble and uh, they find a loophole in the state uh, that allows them to receive money to stay open from the state if they have uh, a, an NCAA football team. So uh, it's about this, this kid and this uh, coach who kind of get pulled into this world they don't belong in. So it's kind of a coming of age movie, but uh, it's a little bizarre with, with the premise, I think. Let's say it's great fun. It's worth watching, for sure, no matter what. It's funny. It's awesome. Fun. Now, so what was the inspiration? Why did you guys bring it to Utah? You guys live in L.A. I would think it would be more convenient to shoot there, but why did you guys decide to bring it to Utah, of all places? I'd say uh, going off of uh, what John's done in the past, we've we had some uh, connections there already that were advan advantageous to us. Yeah, I, I actually worked, I, I used to be a, an artist for animated uh, movies and TV shows, and there was a, I was part of a group of uh, L.A. guys who came up to a studio up there a few years ago, and uh, so I met a lot of people, and um, Utah is very film friendly, so when we got to do this movie, it felt like the right place to, uh, to come, and I knew a lot of people, so it seemed, seemed right. Well, it makes sense, whenever you have that network there, you kind of want to utilize that network and those relationships to keep on building some some great projects. So, so tell me, uh, when are we going to be able to see this film? What, how is that all building up? Uh, film Quest, uh, we are doing our world premiere at eight thirty p.m. on Friday the seventeenth at Jordan Commons Megaplex Theater. And if I understand right, it's a big red carpet thing. We have, I'm assuming we have some of the cast and crew going to be there as well. We will, yeah. We'll have uh, some of the cast there, a uh, few actors, and um, the crew as well should be coming. A lot of the crew there is still local. Awesome. Now, how can people find out more information about Muddy Corman and kind of follow you guys along that journey? We have started, you know, we just, we really put off the finishing of this thing. Um, we just finished it a few days ago. So uh, we do have, a, I think, a Twitter um, account, and I think we have a Facebook page, and we have uh I don't know anything about social media. I think we have other things. Um, but, yeah, we're findable. We don't have a website yet. We're um, This will be our first showing, so really we're pretty early on in this. But if you just search Muddy Corman, you'll find something, I'm sure. Awesome. Hey, thank you guys so much. And, again, you guys will be able to see the world premiere here at Film Quest. It is this Friday. Don't miss it. That's going to be a great red carpet. It's a great time to get out there and meet all the new filmmakers and all the filmmakers that are first have ever come to utah in the first place so you want to come out to all nine days of film quest i have the link in the descriptions below be sure to go buy your tickets and other than that guys have a wonderful day i'll talk to you guys again tomorrow take care